Welcome to the Malawi University of Science and Technology, MAST. MAST is the warm heart of higher education in Malawi and where excellence reigns. MAST is one of Malawi's six public universities and we take pride in pioneering and championing science, technology, innovation and entrepreneurship. Like all the public universities, selection into our undergraduate academic programs is under the National Council for Higher Education in Chair, Harmonized Public University Selection, PUS. As you walk into our beautiful and modern campus in Cholo, you'll be greeted by the welcoming atmosphere that defines excellent higher education environment. Our commitment to academic excellence and respect for diversity is demonstrated by the focus areas of our four schools and their programs, which are a reflection of Malawi's development aspirations and those of the region and beyond. We believe in complementary ideology of STEAM, and that's science, technology, engineering, art, and mathematics. At MAST, we do not only offer classroom or lab-based skills and knowledge, we ensure that our students have a few of the industry through our work integrated learning where all students irrespective of programs of study are required to undergo industry internship in an organization doing work related to their area of study. Knowing Malawi is aspiring for industrialization, we offer all-rounded programs that respond to the current national challenges and as such, entrepreneurship, computer studies, technology and innovation are a must at must. Now that NJ has opened the application window for students who meet the requirements to apply for selection into the public universities, we would like to share with you what is on offer at must. Our programs are offered under schools and we have four schools, namely Malawi Institute of Technology, MIT, Ndata School of Climate and Earth Sciences, NSCES, Bingo School of Culture and Heritage, BISCH, and the Academy of Medical Sciences, AMS. Let's take a closer look at these schools and what they have on offer. Each of these schools offer a homogeneous range of programs, but with unique features. To help you understand the entry requirements for programs under Malawi Institute of Technology, here is Head of Engineering Department, Dr. Richard Nkoma. I will talk about the Malawi Institute of Technology. This is one of the schools that we have here at MAST. Uh, there are four schools, but specifically I will talk about uh, the Malawi Institute of Technology. Under this school, we have four the departments, and these departments are uh, Engineering Department, Computer Systems and Information Technology, and Applied Studies. Amongst these three departments, we have 10 degrees. Uh, if you start for Malawi School Certificate of Education, MSCE, the first one to talk about is Bachelor of Engineering in Biomedical Engineering. This is a five-year degree program, and the entry requirements for this particular degree is that we look for someone with strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. The second one to talk about is Bachelor of Engineering in Chemical Engineering. This too is a five-year degree program and at the end of five years you get an honors degree and the entry requirements we need someone who has strong credits in mathematics, physics and chemistry. Notice that there's a difference between biomedical engineering and chemical engineering in that we don't necessarily require someone with background in biology. The next line is Bachelor of Engineering in Metallurgy and Materials Engineering. This too is a five-year degree program and the entry requirements are that we need someone with uh, strong credits in math mathematics, uh, physics and chemistry. These two we are not uh, looking for someone with uh, biology. As long as we have mathematics physics and chemistry, you qualify uh, to, to, to be considered for this one. The next in line is Bachelor of Engineering in Manufacturing Engineering. This too is a five-year degree program and the entry requirements for MSCE uh, that uh, you need to have 
um, strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. The next in line is Bachelor of Engineering in Manufacturing Engineering. Uh, this is a five-year degree program and the minimum entry requirements are such that you need to have strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. The other program that we have in engineering is Bachelor of Engineering in Polymer and Textile Engineering. This is also a five-year degree program and the entry requirements are that you have to have a strong credit in mathematics, strong credit in biology, physics, and, and chemistry. Uh, apart from the entry requirements that I've mentioned, you also have to have uh, a credit, at least a credit in English. From the engineering side, we have another program uh, that now is in second year. This, we started it uh, three years ago. We have Bachelor of Science in Food Science and Technology. So uh, the entry requirements for Bachelor of Science in Food Science and Technology are that you need to have uh, strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. Moving to another department within the Malay School of uh, Mala Institute of Technology, we have a department that deals with computers and the first program that they are, uh, they are delivering is Bachelor of Science in Business Information Technology. This one, the requirements are that you need to have uh, two strong credits only in mathematics and physics. So we are only looking for strong credits in mathematics and physics for Bachelor of Science in Information Technology. The second one is Bachelor of Science in Computer Systems and Security. These two, we are also looking at someone with a strong credits in mathematics and physics. So these two programs in Computer Systems and Information uh, Technology, we only require uh, strong credits in mathematics and physics. Apart from uh, the credit that you have uh, in English. The last one, the last department that we have, I said uh, applied studies, we have two programs. The first one is uh, Bachelor of Science in Sciences Education. And this one, the minimum entry requirements are that you need to have strong credits in mathematics and physics. The, the last program that I'll talk about today is Bachelor of Science in Mathematical Sciences. And in this program, you need to have uh, minimum strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. So Bachelor of Science in Mathematical Sciences, Bachelor of Science in Food Science and Technology, Bachelor of Science in Sciences Education, Bachelor of Science in Computer Systems and Security, and Bachelor of Science in Business Information Technology. All these are four-year programs. And at the School of Climate and Earth Sciences, NSCES, Executive Dean, Dr. Wilfred Kadewa. In this school, we offer seven undergraduate degree programs. Entry qualifications for all these programs are Malawi School Certificate of Education, uh, and also international qualifications at the level of uh, high school. And for those uh, candidates that have uh, A-levels, they are also uh, allowed to come to these programs and they will start in the second year. So for our seven undergraduate degree programs, we have the first one, uh, Bachelor of Science in Earth Sciences, Geology. The qualifications required for this uh, six credit passes at MSCE, and this includes English. But in addition, the candidates should also have uh, in the following subjects, physics, chemistry, mathematics, and geography, points uh, better than four. So uh, four points upwards, four, three, two, one, uh, are expected uh, for one to be considered uh, into this program. For those coming with A-levels, uh, a minimum of a grade C 
in mathematics, physics, biology, uh, or chemistry. So any three of uh, the subjects I've just listed down, mathematics, physics, uh, biology, or chemistry. Uh, the second degree program is Bachelor of Science in Geoinformation and Earth Science Observation. So this program, again, the uh, entry qualifications at MSCE, sure. one should have uh, better than four points in the following three subjects, physics, chemistry, uh, and computer science, or biology. So the fourth one, there's an option of either computer science or biology. Uh, again, for A-levels, uh, the requirement is that one should have a grade better than a C in any three of the following, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. Uh, but in addition, uh, those with uh, A-levels should at least have gotten uh, a grade of better than a C in geography at GCSE. Our third degree program is Bachelor of Science in Meteorology and Climate Science. Uh, so for this program, the requirement is that one should have at least six credit passes, which includes English, Mathematics, and Geography. Uh, in addition, one should also have uh, a grade better than four in any of the th uh, following three uh, subjects. Our third program is Bachelor of Science in Meteorology and Climate Science. The requirements for this program are an MSc certificate or its equivalent with at least six credit passes, including English, Mathematics, and Geography. In addition, one should have a grade of no more than four points in any three of the following subjects, physics, chemistry, biology, or agriculture. And those are with A-level qualifications, a minimum of a grade C in any three of the following subjects, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. And for those uh, coming in with A-level qualifications, they also must have had a strong credit in geography at all level. Our fourth uh, degree program is Bachelor of Science in Disaster Risk Management. The required qualifications at MSCE, or its equivalent, uh, is a six credit passes, including English. In addition, one should have no more than uh, four points in each of the following subjects, physics, chemistry, mathematics, biology, and geography. And those uh, using A-level qualifications, a minimum of uh, grade C in any three of the following subjects, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. But in addition, they should also have scored a strong credit in geography at all level. Our fourth degree program is Bachelor of Science in Water Quality and Management. Uh, entry qualifications at MSCE, all equivalent, is uh, six credit passes, including English. In addition, the candidates should have a grade of no more than four in each of the following subjects, physics, chemistry, mathematics, and biology. And those uh, coming in with uh, A-level qualifications, a minimum of a grade C in any three of the following subjects, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. Our sixth program is Bachelor of Engineering in Sustainable Energy Engineering and Honors Degree. This program is five years long and the qualifications required uh, for entry is MSCE certificate or its equivalent with at least six credit passes including English. In addition, the candidate should have a grade of no more than four in each of the following subjects, physics, mathematics, and chemistry. For uh, those coming in with uh, GCSE qualifications, a grade of uh, better than a C in the same subjects as listed under MSCE. For A-level uh, graduates, a minimum of a grade C 
in any three of the following subjects, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology. Our seventh uh, degree program is Bachelor of Science in Petroleum Resources, Oil and Gas. Uh, the entry qualifications, uh, MSCE certificate, or its equivalent, with at least six credit passes, including English. In addition, the candidate should have a grade of no more than four in each of the following subjects, physics, chemistry, mathematics, and geography. And those uh, coming in with IGCSEs are the same subjects uh, with a grade of a C or better. And those using A-level qualifications, a minimum of a grade C in any three of the following subjects, mathematics, physics, chemistry, and biology, but in addition, they are also required to have as called a strong credit in geography at all level. Academy of Medical Sciences, AMS, Acting Executive Dean, Dr. Petros Chigwechoka. Academy of Medical Sciences is one of the four uh, schools at MAST. And in the Academy of Medical Sciences, we offer four programs um, in no particular order. The first program is the, the Bachelor of uh, science in medical imaging. Um, uh, to enter into this program, you need a minimum of um, uh, four uh, strong credits. That's in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. Uh, this is a four-year program, and uh, there are lots of career prospects for this program. You can work as a laboratory scientist. You can work as a medical uh, researcher. You can also work in the uh, pharmaceutical industry. Uh, the second program is the Bachelor of Science in Medical Imaging. This is also a four-year program and the entry requirements in this program uh, are strong uh, credits uh, in mathematics, uh, biology, physics and chemistry. And there are also lots of career opportunities for this. You can work as the, um, uh, an imaging analyst as well as uh, diagnostics. And the other one is the uh, Bachelor of Science in uh, Immunology. Uh, this is again another four-year program uh, for you to be admitted into this program you need a minimum of uh, strong credits in mathematics uh, biology physics and chemistry and the, lots of other career opportunities uh, including working as the, an immunologist in any of the uh, medical facilities uh, the last program is the bachelor of science in uh, uh, sports sciences uh, this is also a four-year program uh, for you to be admitted into this program uh, you need a minimum of uh, strong credits in mathematics, biology, physics, and chemistry. And there are millions and millions of career opportunities for this program. You can work as a, a physical education teacher. You can also work as a sports psychologist and several other opportunities within the uh, sports um, uh, community as well as the sports industry. Bingo School of Culture and Heritage, B-I-S-C-H, Executive Dean, Dr. Atikondam Tenjen Kochi. In the Bingo School of Culture and Heritage, we have five amazing programs. I'll start with the Bachelor of Arts in Indigenous Knowledge Systems and Practices. You need six credits for this program, including English. But you also need to get not more than four in three of the following. Creative Arts, uh, History, Geography, Bible Knowledge, Social Studies, uh, Bible Knowledge or Religious Studies, Life Skills. The other program is Bachelor of Arts in African Musicology. You have to have six credits in this program, including English. But you also not, you need to have not more than four in any of the three. Creative Arts, Life Skills, Social Skills, uh, Geography, History and Bible Knowledge. This program runs for four years. Then we have the Bachelor of Arts in Language, Communication and Culture. Language, Communication and Culture is a program that runs for four years. You also need to get six credits for this program, including English. But you also need to get credits in any two of the following. Creative Arts, Chichewa, Geography, History, Life Skills or Social Skills. The other program is the Bachelor of Arts in Cultural Economy. Bachelor of Arts in Cultural Economy also runs for four years. You need to have six credits in this program. And you also need to have a credit in English and mathematics. You also need credits in any two of the following. Creative arts, life skills, social skills, 
geography and history. The last program in the Bingo School of Culture and Heritage is Bachelor of Arts in Archives and Record Management. You need six credits for this program. The credits are in English and Mathematics, but you also need credits in any two of the following. Geography, History, Life Skills, Social Skills, and Bible Knowledge or Religious Studies. All the programs in the Bingo School of Culture and Heritage run for four years. There you are with a combined 26 programs for you to choose from. Make sure you meet the requirements for any program that you choose. Must programs are introduced after thorough consultation processes to ensure that they are relevant and directly respond to national needs. Our alumni and current students are ambassadors and witnesses. Um, at MAST, students not only thrive in their studies, but also in their social lives. We have cultural festivals, sports and games, and social weekends that facilitate student engagement and participation. We also have free internet access. What are you waiting for? Apply now. Here at MAST, irrespective of the programs we are doing, every student is offered computer lessons. You know, in today's world, computer is the basic need in every industry. So computer is offered to every student here at MAST. Apart from that, MAST emphasizes on entrepreneurship. Here at MAST, every student is offered entrepreneurship so that he or she is able to stand out there in today's world of less job opportunities. Reflect my time at MAST, it has been an exciting time. So in our, first, in our fifth year, uh, we had also to go for what we call a work integrated learning whereby students are supposed to go into uh, various industries in Malawi where now we have to also to understand the practical and that really helped us to bridge the gap between the theoretical knowledge that we were learning in class into the real world applications. So it was such an exciting time and that also prepared me for my masters in Stellenbosch where I ended up getting a distinction. So my advice to aspiring students is to First of all, know yourself, because that is what exactly I did. And also, mass helped me because mass is a center of excellency, so it instilled me the drive to pursue excellency. MAST is the warm heart of higher education in Malawi and where excellence reigns.